everybody, welcome. My name is Mr. Moober and I will be giving you a quick and very brief tutorial on how to translate your character in the X or Y planes and keeping their feet locked during a walk cycle. I'll be using the ultimate walker for this uh, tutorial and it is a lovely little rig if you want to practice making walk cycles, getting your follow through and your overlap nice and balanced, getting your weighting and everything uh, worked out. And uh, all of the translation and rotation controls all uh, export over to the Ultra Bony Rig, or Ultimate Bony Rig. So you can easily uh, translate any walk cycles you do on this little dude uh, over to your Ultra Bony, Ultimate Bony, whatever it's called. Um, anyway, uh, straight to the point then. So with this walk cycle, we're going to be going into the graph editor, so you're going to want to bring that up. And with the graph editor, we are basically doing everything and entirely in here. So you want to take your super mover. Uh, you first want to create a key on the zero key with your translate Z. So select your translate Z, right click and sh and click key selected. This will create a reference point for where you place your keys later on. All right. So you're going to go ahead and select your foot controller for your for, for the first foot that contacts the ground. And you're going to go into your graph editor and locate the points where your foot is contacting the ground. For me, I know it is here because this is where my foot is contacting the ground for the longest period of time and where it is translating smoothly in the solid motionless walk cycle. So what I'll do is I'll select the keys where my character's foot is planted on the ground where I want it to move. I will hit control C. I will select the super mover, go to the control translate Z value, make sure I'm on key one and paste. Then I'll go over to trans uh, frame 12 and paste again. Ooh paste again there we go and what that allows you to do is it allows you to hit play and your character will just walk aimlessly to his doom and if you take a look take a nice close look you can see that my character does not have any sliding with his feet because his feet are translating backwards as quickly as his entire person is moving forwards so it's just a quick little trick that you can use to sync up your walk cycles and uh, block and posing very quickly uh, I recommend using it for uh, flat animation uh, if you're just doing like a walk cycle from left to right it's a little tricky if you're implant if you're implementing uh, rotation and anything like along those lines if you have any questions about that I can show you in a later tutorial but uh, for now I'm just gonna stick with this uh, thank you very much for watching and I hope you enjoyed the tutorial and I hope the information was useful thank you goodbye